everyone welcome back to another video so today i don't really have any crafting to show you i worked a little bit on <sighs> sorry dogs next door that won't ha be happening very soon i'll get to that later. um i finished i was gonna make this into a blanket but i've decided that i'm going to make it into a little lovey. I haven't decided what animal I'm gonna make it into yet, but this is gonna be like the blanket of the bottom of it. So, um, look at being bitten by something. Ow. Anyway, um, so yeah, I have plenty of that yarn left to do something with. I'm not sure what, I was thinking maybe a rabbit. <laughs> I'm not sure. And I'm keeping it in this bag that I got from Lingcraft, which is like an Australian craft store. But yeah, that's really the only thing I've been working on. I haven't really been doing much else. Um, oh I swear I'm being bitten by something and it's really, really hurting. bitten um but i do have exciting news so as of today i have a house it's a little townhouse so i'll be living in the same town that i work in which will be nice for travel and um it's a good price for where it is and everything like that um it has two bedrooms so obviously one will be my bedroom the other one i will have she knows all my craft crafting stuff in and it'll be where I will film as well um, the fun process is moving everything um, that will happen later next week um, so I've signed my lease I've paid my bond and two weeks rent um, I've got the ball rolling with getting everything connected you know water power internet gas all that kind of fun stuff um yeah i just need to i've got a couple of cupboards here to go through get rid of a bunch of crap and um start kind of organizing stuff so um yeah i I've, I've picked up a few bits and pieces here and there i have um a lot of my furniture already um i did get some stuff from kmart um which i like them they have awesome stuff um i was gonna go and get my fridge washing machine microwave all that stuff today but they didn't have the ones i wanted in stock so i'm gonna try a local place here in town and see what i can get um I did pick up and um, I had one of these before but it was wasn't as powerful and I thought you know what I'm moving into a new place so I'm just gonna finally get one bite the bullet so to speak <laughs> you get that joke in a minute so I picked up this uh, Nutribullet um, so yeah I've got that um, and I also went and picked up the Deadly Premonition 2. So I got the first one of this um, Nintendo Switch game when I got my Switch. Um, but I had the second one on pre-order. As many of you may know, I got a Switch Lite. Not that long ago. And I love it. I play it all the time. I need to charge it though. Um, and... I initially was going to get like the full console, not just the light. And I thought, nah, I'll just get it. I can get the other one later. So last week I pre ordered the actual um, console. And I was going to get the all grey one. And I went to pick up the game and I asked if they'd come in yet because they, they had to order it. And he's like, oh, we have the neon one. 
um, but the grey ones haven't come in yet. I'm like, oh, he goes, you can have one of the neon ones if you want. So that's what I did. I picked up um, this today. I already had put some money down on it, so um, I'd already started paying for it. But yeah, so I'm not going to unbox this until I'm in the new place and everything's organised because I'll just have, it's just another thing I have to pack up. I mean, I know I can just put it back in the box, but it's just going to stay in there for now. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, I've already got a few other bits and pieces. Um, so yeah, next weekend. Um, it'll probably take me a while to sort everything and organise everything and just get it how I want it. But it'll it'll be good so it's more just kind of clearing stuff out this weekend um <coughs> mum and I went and looked at it today um how the process worked was I applied for it I don't remember when I applied for it I think it was last week early last week then Tuesday, I got a email saying that it had gone to the owner, owner of the property for approval. And then um, yesterday, I actually had an inspection in another property. And um, I also got a phone call from the real estate agent saying I'd been pre-approved for this one. And I was like, well, what does pre-approved mean? Because, you know, I've had a really shitty experience. I didn't say that, but I had a pretty average experience, shall we say, with another real estate agent in the same town. And she goes, basically, um, we can set up an inspection tomorrow for you to come and have a look at the property. And if you want to take it, it's yours. So I was excited. I kind of was half excited. And then I was like, wait, did she really just say that? Um. <clears throat> because I've been applying for so many. Um, yeah, I don't I don't know whether it's because I work full time, whether it's because I don't have pets, I don't have children. It, that worked in my favour too. I don't know. Um, there's nothing against having either, but um, I don't know. So, yeah, it's in a nice, quiet complex. Um, I think there's, there's quite a few other um, townhouses in the same unit complex so um yeah it'll be it'll be interesting um moving everything um i don't think I, it will really sink in until i actually spend like my first night in there i think that's when it will kind of like sink in yep this is my my house like <clears throat> but um yeah so it's it's interesting so I'm I'm yeah, I just need to kind of be ruthless and um get rid of a bunch of stuff um but yeah it's it's gonna be fun to set up my own little space um even when my mum was walking through she's like oh this is really really nice and I turn around in front of the real estate, real estate agent I'll go well you're not moving in with me <laughs> which the real estate agent thought was hilarious um but yeah she's really nice um and actually as we were driving home she called me and was like I just w wanted to kind of get everything going and she'd emailed me my lease to sign my um, like my email saying that I got the property, um, the, um, I don't know what it, they have like this service where you can have them connect all of your, uh, like water, power, gas, internet, um, and they have NBN. Yay. Um, so that's connected and from the plans that I was looking at it's going to be about $65 a month which is not too bad for the size of plan so um, 
yeah, it'll it'll be interesting um, to see how that all works. But yeah, it's just moving the stuff. <laughs> Ugh. But, yeah, I'm, I'm excited, but even now, like, it still hasn't sunk in yet. Like, I went and told my boss today, she's like, yeah, that's so exciting. Um, and, yeah, I think once I've been in there and I get kind of settled in, it'll be good. But it's everything beforehand that's going to be a pain, but, you know. So, yeah, not really much crafting happening. Um, and probably won't post anything like crafting wise probably for the next week just because I'll be packing stuff and organizing stuff and um yeah so I think that's kind of all really um I will give you guys a little bit of a tour of my craft room when I finally organize it um, but yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well, and, um, I will see you guys again soon. Bye.